Well guys, we got a 2017 Fusion in here with a 1.5 liter EcoBoost. I've got two issues going on here. Low coolant level and the lady's saying that sometimes um, it doesn't act like it has a lot of power. It's hesitating and almost like it's misfiring at times. So what do we what do we do? We got to pull coolant reservoir cap, pressure test the system, pull spark plugs out. This does have the coolant intrusion issue um, on this 1.5 liter 2018 Fusion. I was wrong. I think I said 17 in the first part of this video. But if we actually look at the criteria, it's 2014 to 2019 Fusion built on or before 10 June 2019. This was built back in 2018. After 10 June 2019, they started using the updated block. Um, and you only have to have one of the following conditions. Low coolant level, which it does have. White exhaust smoke. It doesn't have that. Uh, runs rough. She did complain about it running rough and sometimes acting like it was underpowered with or without a check engine light. So it doesn't have to have a check engine light. But two of these things she's already complained about so it let me turn this light off so it does meet the criteria for these two things here and then most of the vehicles we actually do are the escapes built on or before 8 april 2019 um but now i've got a fusion that i'm going to do so i'm going to go ahead and order the motor and everything for it let's go through a quick i'm going to go ahead and get the stuff ordered that i need for this and send her to work and then um uh, get her on her way and then come back service procedure engine at normal operating temperature pressurize the cooling system to 20 psi and hold for five hours did the coolant system pressure drop more than four psi after five hours yes proceed to step three remove the spark plugs inspect for coolant in the cylinders remove the engine and replace with short block this has only been on here for 10 minutes and it already went from 20 psi down to 15 so it already meets the criteria and if you want to see what it looks like there's coolant right there in the cylinder you can't really see it too well but right over there in the corner to the left that's coolant that's starting to puddle up i'll show you what a cylinder looks like without coolant in it i'll go back to cylinder one See, there's no oh there is it's cooling cooling is starting to form right there too so cylinder one and cylinder two got cooling in it see before there was no cooling right there that's cool cooling puddling up check cylinder three Right there. Sorry, this is a. It's cool and starting to puddle up in cylinder three, too. Check cylinder four. Nothing in four, but cylinders one, two, and three already have coolant in it. So that's uh, diagnosing the 1.5 liter EcoBoost Fusion. There we go. For it to be as chunky as it is, and it's got a lot of white soot and stuff all over it, like it's been burning coolant. That was my first tall tale that this is not running right. You guys, that was part one. I am going to do part two separately, and that's going to be all of the parts itemized from top to bottom with part numbers on what you need to do this uh, block replacement on the coolant intrusion for the Fusion. Thank you.
wait for part two, it's coming. It's already recorded, I just have to load it.